गुड इवनिंग सुनील गुड इवनिंग सर Yes, Mr. Uh, can you show me your ID card? Uh, sir, uh, this is my Aadhaar and this is my college ID card. Can you show again? Uh, yes, sir. Uh, keep it at one. Yeah, keep it. Uh, okay, thank you, sir. Okay, now. Uh, firstly, good, good evening, sir, and thank you for giving me a chance to introduce myself. Uh, my name is Sumit Kumar Yadav, and I am from Lucknow, Uttar Pradesh. Uh, currently, I am pursuing my uh, bachelor's in electrical engineering from Babu Banasi Das, Northern India Institute of Technology, affiliated to Dr. A. P. J. Abdul Kalam Technical University, uh, with the aggregate score of seventy-one percent. Uh, I have done my schooling from uh, Albin Global School, uh, Lucknow, Uttar Pradesh. uh we are total five members in our family and uh, uh my hobbies are uh, listening music uh cycling and cooking uh my strength is uh, i am self motivated motivated and uh, i am punctual and well disciplined uh my weakness is uh, i am bit emotional sort of person uh, due to which uh, i have i consider it as a strength also because of which uh, i have better relationship with the people uh my uh, other than uh, other than academic i have also interest in uh, learning new things so i have done several uh, courses during my uh, college days and uh, i have also handled and being a part of a group uh, of several projects in my college uh, currently i am fresher and i do not have any work experience uh, my short term goal Uh, right now is to get placement in company like infosys and to en- enhance my knowledge and skill uh, for the company uh, so okay sir. so mr uh, 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 have you uh, means have you uh, any time uh, you know gone through any course on uh, it like during your uh, curriculum or outside if you have done any it course uh, programming course Uh, sir i have not done a uh, specific programming course but i have done a uh, few automation courses uh, like embedded okay. uh, embedded system and plc scada uh, which i have done during my um, summer breaks last year okay so as a as a part of your engineering have you uh, did you have a course on c language or any programming fundamentals uh, sir uh, yes i do have uh, it in my second semester uh, subject uh, named python programming definitely sir Okay, okay. Okay, Sumit. So, uh, I am okay. Uh, tell me your strength and weakness. Uh, sir, my strength is uh, I am self motivated and uh, I am punctual and I am very dedicated and disciplined towards my work. And my weakness is basically I am bit emotional sort of person. Uh, due to which uh, I it's bit uh, difficult for me to uh, shift and uh, get away from the people I live in. so somehow it is also a strength because uh, due to this i have better relationship with the people and i can get comfortable in new places uh, with a short span of time okay okay sumit okay thank you so sumit if you have to work during uh, late night every day are you comfortable uh sir definitely i can work uh, day, uh, at night time uh, because it it will be a part of my job so uh, if the company wants to me uh, work at that time then i will definitely will work at that particular time okay so mr so, uh, you have one more team member okay uh, who is working with you uh, from your uh, say from your college or your own person but he is not working uh, and uh, so uh, uh, in that way uh, in that scenario how we will uh, tackle how we will handle that that okay some person is not working but some work is there then maybe some other person has to do or you have to do so in that scenario how will you handle uh so firstly uh, i will talk to that person that uh, what is the basically reason uh, because of which he is not working uh, it is related personal reason can be or it can be professional also so firstly i will okay. go, go for that and uh, if it is due to his personal reason then uh if it is it will be possible then i will try to uh, work uh, maybe uh, with him and uh, i will try to 
help him out and uh, ask him to uh, to basically uh, work uh, and uh, uh, properly so that uh, those things don't get messed up and if uh, it is something serious then i will definitely uh, make him uh, stay for a bit uh, time and i will okay. do help him out okay so much okay so thank you so do you have any questions or any doubts uh, i am done with the interview uh, i will provide the feedback but if you have any doubts or any you know thing that you want to tell uh, yes sir i do have uh, basically sir i do not, uh, yes sir uh, i do not have a very strong uh, backup or uh, background of my uh, coding sections so can you please uh, tell me that what is the best preferable language that infosys uh, look for or any latest technology that uh, pressure should be aware of uh, so actually uh, not like a language but you should understand the programming standards and how uh, algorithm or how uh, normal software development life cycle works okay so that yes. that applies to most of the uh, different programming language Okay. But at least you should know that how system works, how uh, what is the architecture and how what is the life cycle of software development. Okay. Okay, sir. Okay, so Miss, uh, thank you. It was nice talking to you. Okay. Thank you, sir. It was nice to talking to you, sir. Too.